Safety Net's a small local charity working with victims of sexual and domestic violence. We work with children, we work with women, and actually 20% of our clients are men. We've got some funding from the Coalfields Regeneration Trust, um, which is £10,000 to help us recruit and train a volunteer coordinator. The volunteer coordinator is going to be working predominantly over in the west of Cumbria, where there's significant need. And what we want to do is really tap into local talent and provide some structure and support for people to come forward and give their time to safety net. It felt absolutely amazing. You know, we're really, really excited about that. It's like a, a new project for us to. We've always had volunteers here, um, but we've never really had the time to support them in the way that ne they need to be supported. So we're not really using the social capital that's out there. Um, so for me, it just felt so exciting to be delivering a new project here in Cumbria. I think the Coalfields Regeneration Trust is really, really wanting to regenerate the area and um, working with volunteers is a really great way to do that. We're working with local people and they're telling us what they want to see happening in their communities. So I think that was really appealing to um, that charity in particular. We predominantly provide therapeutic support, we're a trauma-informed um, service and by that we mean we start where people are at, we recognise that people who've been raped, who've been sexually assaulted, abused, might not want to talk about what's happened to them and that can be a huge barrier for people, the fear that they've got to tell us what's happened to them and they don't. You can come to this service, you can get support, therapy, help you recover um, and we'll start with you where you're at.